helping. Been a little bit slow, but yeah, I think we're getting in. There we go. Hopefully everything looks good, by the way. I, I never uh, use my capture card on my Xbox. So this will be interesting. Hey, Jay, I do appreciate that. We are slowly growing, but it's been a, uh, a steady growth lately. Wow, we're like... I didn't even hit a button, did we? Just like an... It... Oh, here we go. Every driver has a story to tell. Of their first race. Their first race car. Drivers will talk about their victories, their losses, and their journey. Here is the starting point for racing dreams, where aspiring drivers begin forging their own legacy. For a select, devoted few, awaits not just the finish line, but the chance to become a racing legend. Graphics are amazing, all right? Welcome to Forza Motorsport. I'm here to help you achieve racing glory. Now, this is where your journey starts. And trust me when I say it's gonna be a hard fought, hard driving road to win the cup. It'll be a road full of choices you'll have to make. And here's the first one. Who are you? <laughs> who am I? How dare you ask who I am? You don't know me. Yes. I'm guessing we had to choose male or female. I usually go female in every game because, I mean, as a guy, I would rather watch a female run around a game forever, but let's make this one actually be this time. I'm gonna change gender color. I don't know, mostly. Time to pick out your first driver gear. You'll come across more as Dude, you race. that's actually kinda cool. Oh, oh. I mean, the standard is cool, but I kinda like the middle one. I'm, I'm, I'm weird about colors. I kinda like the last one. Kind of. I don't feel in that middle one. What do you guys think? You know, which one do you guys like the most? Guys and gals, uh, which do you all agree on so far? Um, I'm kind of feeling, I mean, I even kind of like the last one. Teal is always kind of a cool color. I'm actually wearing a purple shirt right now, as funny as that is, so. I know, right? There should be like 8 billion genders, right, apparently. <laughs> They're all pretty nice. I'm partial to the Navy. I agree, yeah, the Navy's pretty cool. I like the middle too. I might just go middle for now. Is everybody probably just went the. Uh, yeah, you know what? We're gonna go last. We're gonna go last. From here, good. you I have like a it. choice between starting your campaign for the Forza Drivers Cup, jumping into multiplayer to race against drivers from all over the world, or exploring at your own pace. I'm gonna actually start out with the career because we're doing career tonight. I want to get through a lot of that first. So multiplayer will come in a couple of days. I actually can't afford Xbox Gold right now. As soon as I can, I'll do some multiplayer. But today we're gonna start out with the career. The Forza Drivers' Cup, the world's largest, most diverse, sanctioned motorsport series. For decades, it's drawn the racing world's best. To win, it will take speed, versatility, oh, we can race and diesels. adaptability. Spanning five continents and the world's most legendary circuits, only a few will climb to the top, where racing immortality awaits the winner. But first, step into the shoes of past winners and learn what it takes to win driving's top prize. Okay. Speed. The defining element of racing. Speed is more than the miracles of engineering and design. It is drivers who embrace the pursuit of going ever faster. Last season's cup winner, Michael Mueller, is one of those drivers. Known for bringing record-breaking cars to the track, he turned heads at the Dubai Invitational when he drove a car no one knew existed. This is so cool already. I'm loving, like, the dialing of it. And I played Forza Horizon 3, but I've never played any of the motorsports. I'm really excited about them. I 
102 degrees. That's a bit of a spicy day. <laughs> and again, thank you all for hanging out today. I really appreciate it. Now we can see how the hay boy is in this game. Well, this is like literally Hopefully it's looking good for you guys. Like I said, I'll usually use, use a capture card to lock this fucking little bit of issues with it. I want to get in cockpit. I need to set up some... Turn off a lot of the assists. Oh. Yeah, definitely a lot more in touch. Why are you not a fan at all? <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. Okay, we could fix that on April. Uh, let's see. Hold on, let me put the assist. Yeah, you can use the assist here to tweak how your car handles. Go medium for now, just so we can get you a suggested line. We'll keep on. Yes. We'll leave it for here until we get used. To it. That's your volume. I usually drop it down to about forty to fifty. Bring that down. I figure out which camera. Okay, that's what I thought it was. Oh, Woo. a lot different already. Which would come on a little bit more. It feels more sim than Project Cars does. That's good. A lot more slide with a little bit of adjustment on those assists. It's going to be fun. Got to used to how much braking throttle. Feel the amount of breaking loose and breaking and breaking loose when you get the throttle back on. Kind of cool. Definitely feels it. <laughs> it doesn't look it, but it feels it, that's for sure. Don't forget, there's still some assists on too, so once we turn them all off, we'll see how soon it really gets. Yeah, it definitely feels it though. Like, the cars actually feel heavier, they feel like they have a bit more. Uh, resistance and also let me know if the audio is better for you guys. I don't want it to blow out your ear. Versatility means becoming a master of any vehicle. I wish I had a wheel. Sadly, the, the wheel support on this isn't really that great. Be versatile because they will um, I'm hoping they patch the wheel support on it. I wish I had a wheel. If I could afford one, I would fly. easily buy one in a heartbeat. Magellan, oh man, are we actually Maria gonna drain races there? Earned the series points lead and eventually the Forza Drivers Cup itself. Yeah, I'd kill to, to have. Still a bit loud, really. I turned it down to like 30%. There you go. Now I turned you guys down to 20%. But we'll see if that's still a bit loud. I do appreciate it. Thank you guys for the input. That's going to help out a lot. 
Uh, there's trophy trucks? Not sure. I really, like I said, this is my first ever Forza. I don't know what's all in this yet. I know there's over 700 cars in the game, though. That's all I know. This will be interesting to drive one of these. Oh, man. Oh, these are so big. Nuts. I wish the guy had to go a little bit faster. Come on. Did it get around? Oh. Trying to get around. It's so hard to tell how big the vehicle is and where the other guys are. Turn the understeer. These things are so heavy. So heavy. Yeah, it, it, I'm, I'm weird about simulated games. I like to play them all in first person so it actually feels like a simulator, you know. Heartbreaking, heartbreaking inside. Yeah. <laughs> Those rumble strips. Yeah, once we start getting the tracks down a little bit and getting used to the handling, we'll take off the... Uh, I might actually turn it to semi, not full. That'll need to be shown the whole way around the track. Kind of like where I need to start adjusting my braking. You know, the beginner stuff. I'm really liking it, though. Like, it feels great. Don't forget, if you don't have an Xbox One, guys, don't worry. It's now on PC as well, which is really cool that they're bringing all Xbox uh, One exclusives now to PC. I'll tell you one thing. This game probably looks amazing uh, in 4K. I'll have to set that up one of the days and try it solo. This thing just feels like a behemoth inside of it. No, it's only on Xbox One and P uh, PC. Yeah, it's Xbox exclusive. It's red. Oh, okay. Yeah, joys of not knowing uh, what profile you guys are on. Dude, we've got a good commanding lead. I'm enjoying this, like, semi-practice thing. Let me know if the audio is still loud for you guys. Because I turned it way down. We'll see if my uh, mic and everything sounds good. I'm just going to get it all worked. Oh, first wet race. Adaptability. Only the prepared will be able to cope with any change on the track. Cup legend Yukio Takagi is renowned for remaining focused even during a downpour. Here, here comes driving track, skill. Drivers must adapt. Oof. The speed and versatility are nothing when no two laps are the same. be interesting. I have a feeling we're going to spin in the first corner and get used to the rain. And if anyone, I was growing up, I, uh, my very first car, I was lucky enough. Well, I, I drove my grandmother's car for a while until I had it done. But my very first car ever was a 69 El Camino Super Sport. It had over 400 horsepower in it. And the very first time I took it out in the rain, I spun it on a, like, 5 mile per hour turn out of a stop sign. <laughs> it was not fun. <laughs> Luckily, nothing happened. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's slick. Hey. Ah, oh, thank you for that follow. Appreciate it, man. Flattering some MCs up in. 
Oh, the stream. Oh, my God. The understeer is real. Ooh. Oh, yeah. The amount of braking and throttle. You got to be really careful in the rain. But that's good. That's how it should be. The graphics are amazing. I want to go back in car, though. Why does it keep taking me out of car? Go back in. There you go. Trying to dive on the inside. It's not going to help my apex. Biden. Yep, just got it. <laughs> yeah, I'm like right at the very beginning of the game, pretty much. This rain definitely gives a difference. See the Corvette right behind me. I don't think we'll win this one. We'll win the first two. I wish. I wish I had a wheel. Oh, that's what I get for reading chat. Oh, shit. We're good. We're good. We're good. Nobody saw anything. Oh, my God. That's a chicane. Oh, God. <laughs> I would you Oh, shit. One second. I'll reach out in two seconds. The rain is... Definitely uh <laughs> definitely a challenge. I like it though, it's a lot of fun. Sadly we only got second on that one, but either way. Uh which driving mode do you prefer? It's as soon as I can actually take off all assists and um get used to the game, I'll be happy. Like I I like treating a sim like a sim. You know what I mean? I don't like having any assists on except for just learning what I'm doing kinda like right now. But once we uh once we get into the game, I'm all about turning everything off and uh, go first person on everything. Uh, helmet cam style. I wish I had a wheel, though. I would kill to have a wheel. So as soon as we start getting the game down a little bit, we'll turn off, like I said, all assists. Uh, get the track line off and uh, start going through the career. Now you've seen what it takes to wheel. Speed, versatility, and adaptability. Now it's up to you. <laughs> no, it's fine, Jen. Premier contest in all of racing. The Forza Drivers Cup draws only the best. Yeah, it'll be a challenge. But when you lift that trophy, everyone will know you're the world's greatest driver. Pretty interesting, so locked. Welcome to the Seeker Championship. Now, each series is based on more than 50 car divisions featuring different types of vehicles. So it's time. Oh, there's trophy trophy trucks in it. Which series will you choose first? Interesting. I might as well just start from the very beginning. Yeah. Ooh, we get to do some old. Uh, yeah. Let's start with a hatch race. If you're gonna be racing, you'll need a car. Now the first one is on me, so go ahead and pick what you want. These cars prove you shouldn't judge a vehicle by its size. Designed and built for performance and practicality, these hot hatches are perfect for racing around tight road circuits. Lots to choose from at the very beginning. Ooh, the new Civic Type R's. Those are actually pretty cool cars for Civic. I hate to admit it. Are you really into motorsport? Like, are you talking about motorsports in general or Forza motorsport? This is actually my first ever Forza, so I have no idea. And hear the guy talking. Dang, I wonder if we could... We'll have to adjust that more. I'm not sure which I'm going to go with. The Focuses are really nice, actually. They're actually a pretty damn good car to buy if you want to get started into, like, Auto Track or Auto Course. Auto Cross, I should say. Uh, maybe. I'm kind of feeling the focus. I might just do. Yeah, I might just go with that. Drive the Mini Cooper. Actually, Mini Coopers are pretty decent if you could get them uh, tuned right. A Mercedes AMG. Hmm. Yeah, I'm just gonna go with the focus off the start. Focuses could be built up to be pretty nice. 
Yeah, they have every car in the game except for uh, Toyota. As odd as that is, Toyota got dropped out. Hopefully, I can get my adjustments. Are again about? Yeah, Audis are great. Audis are amazing cars. Yeah, there's. I wish I could turn it on my own. That's kind of. Uh, but yeah, I'm kind of. From what I see from all the cars, it looks like the Focus definitely does have the better overall. Oh, well, that's interesting. You're just glad that this is now on PC. Oh, that's kind of cool. And that's kind of cool, actually. It goes with, like, the standard style of it, but I want something not too flashy yet. Not too, I mean, I might even just do that. <laughs> Oh, that's actually cool. Yeah, third one was sick. I agree with that. Yeah. This guy. I thought that was actually pretty cool. You know what? Let's just do that. I like it. I have to hit X to free luck. Okay, that's kind of cool, actually. I can imagine a lot of the guys that have played Forza all their life are like, Bono, you don't know anything. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Ways of the first time playing this, but yeah, that's cool. It's just cool how you can do that. Just get it. There's free car. We can always adjust it later. Get back into the career. My plan, actually, uh, what I really want to do is whenever we have a chance to, I'm going to buy any car that I actually have owned growing up. So it's going to be kind of funny. Or my dad had, uh, race, he's collected muscle cars. Choices. You can change your gear, tune your car, and more. Never hurts to give everything one more look before you hit the track. That'll be interesting. <laughs> Don't worry, Brad. Hey, that's why we play these games to learn, right? Why? Loading forever. Unload. <laughs> and that's a long load. Uh, to upgrades assist. Let's go a little bit further. Hey, uh, Omen, thank you so much for the follow. Appreciate that. Welcome to. No, breaking. Oh, see, that's what I want. That sounds bad. We'll, we'll go to hard for now and we'll get. Just a manual in a bit once you get more used to it. Now. Graphics are really good, though. I'm happy. Um, I wish I could be playing this on PC, but um, it's really glitchy on PC. The port is not the best yet. Um, tuning. I mean, we just got the car. I want to see the shop, though. We have a lot of money, but I don't know if I'd want to waste it on this. Yeah, so the division we can't even upgrade anyway, so we might as well just leave it. My tunes? Oh, so you could keep a list of your tunes? That's cool. Okay, everything's set. Start when you're ready. Hard difficult. Now this will change how the other drivers out there will perform. We'll leave it on it's average for now. Like I said, it's our first actual skills. race, so let's see how this goes. Yep, exactly, exactly. It's got to kind of, you know what I mean, just make your way through. Uh, well, let's change our audio a little bit. So, you guys said you couldn't hear him talking too well, so let's do this. Let's turn down car volumes, because that's pretty loud. Turn all that down a bit. About equal. That up. Music is pretty loud. At least I don't think anything in it is copyright. Subtitles, yeah, why not? I think that should be good. I think that'll be good. Nice. 
Language, we're good. HUD. This is all. Review cockpit. I'll go back to that later. I just want to get back into rate. Right. All right, we should be good. It'll be interesting. First one a little bit harder. Um, well, less assist than we had before. Uh, we'll see. I don't know. It's interesting. Kind of excited. Ribbons racing. Train paint. I had room. Letting me know I don't. <laughs> so that'll be pit lane. steer that whole corner because why not pushing it we get used to apex and we'll see how that works got a bit more understeer than i expected though that's not a every game has their own sim elements to it yeah i see that once we start upgrading cars and stuff it'll definitely feel a bit more grippy actually handles really well for all stuff. Of course this is like beginner stuff. <laughs> yeah, the car is all stock, actually. These cars are actually pretty dang quick out of the showroom. I remember, I think they're... Oh, I can't remember off the top of my head. I can't remember... I don't want to say they're 300, but they're close to it. Horsepower stock. It's all-wheel drive, too. Uh, my car IRL right now, as sad as it is, I'm driving a uh, a uh, inherited car just as a daily driver because the mileage is great. I actually drive a Chevy Cobalt. Nothing good. It's very boring. But the last car I did have that I still own, which sadly a tree landed on it, it pisses me the fuck off. We got a 97 GST Clips with 386 horsepower. Right about somewhere in between 363. Uh, we had an Evo 316G turbo, full front mount intercooler, full piping through, three inch through down pipe out, ECM link, like everything we wanted to do. It was pretty fun, but sadly never really got it to full capacity and landed on it. It's just sitting in the backyard crying. It was black on black. Um, sadly, the interior was tan and black. Never got to finish it the way I wanted to. It was a fun car, though. It was my first tuner, so pretty good. Oh, nice. Yeah, Lancers are great. They're the, uh, you know, 
nice just below the uh or the uh ways of reading while I'm thinking. <laughs> kind of an idiot. Cup regulations state that no matter how you do in any given race, you'll acquire series points. And the better you finish, the more points you earn. Okay. That was actually pretty fun with that car. Um, I feel like, I feel like there's maybe a couple more um, assists we could turn off on the next one. But the more we play, the better we get you know, at the game. That we could... uh, so we're in present now. Cause... Oh, yeah. Oh, exactly. Oh, yeah. All-wheel drive is the way to go. get some easy rewards just keep driving the more you drive the faster you get that. to a milestone and milestones can net you some great stuff for all your hard work let me thank you for the host appreciate that thank you so much did you just uh, get done streaming or have you been streaming today hopefully the loading on this one doesn't take as long as the last rain. one best to prep for a wet track yeah, I don't even know how to prep in this game yet. That's going to be something we'll have to do later is learn uh, tuning and adjusting uh, suspension and tires and everything. For Still have no idea what the prize crate is. <laughs> just as I was about to look at it, it's like, ah, oh, no, forget that. Let's just move on. I'm just chilling. Ah, oh, great. I still appreciate that host. Hope you're doing well tonight. In these crates, crates you'll find driver gear, mods, and special vehicles to add to your collection. Huh. Well, that's interesting. I'd have to look into that later. Large mystery crate. Those are kind of expensive. We'll have to save some money. Let's get into this. No better way to learn this game than uh, to start doing races on different uh, types of... Uh, Weather conditions until we understand what we got to do. Oh, I'm sorry. I hate those. Those are the worst, especially when they go like worse of a headache than they were before. Like when it goes full blown migraine or anything. Oh. See the whole name, but thank you, Matt, for the follow. Appreciate that. I will give you your full recognition when we can get around this guy. Come on. First actual rain race in the career besides that beginner one. Again, thank you everybody for hanging out tonight. Just having fun. The very first Forza. So any of you that are better at this game, hey, if you want to throw me some tips, go ahead. I mean, I don't want a whole lot of backseat gameplay, but still, at the same time, there's a lot of stuff I got to learn about this game. So. Oh. Sideways. Oh, I'm oh, sorry. Let me get to feel. Okay. I think it was Matt O'Mello. Oh, the understeer with the rain. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We're not going to re rewind, though. I feel like that's stupid in games. I don't, I don't like doing that. If I lose, I lose. Like I said, if you're gonna play a, a simulator type game, then you play it like a sim. We'll keep going. That was my mistake. I'm surprised we got back on though. That was soup. Big Red, what's up, dude? Learning how to uh, slowly roll in the throttle on the ring. Big thing. Also, the braking. You don't want to just. I I'm really liking the way the cars handle in this game. They did a really good job on having a simulated feel, but like I said, it's a little bit arcadey still, kind of, like tiny bit right now, because we don't have all these. That will come maybe even just after this one.
Actually, I do. I have uh, Horizon 3, actually. That was the only other Forza I played, but it was a lot more arcadey, you know what I mean? So this is like my first Forza Motorsport. But yeah, that was a great one. But Bobby, you take care of it. Thanks for stopping by. I do appreciate it. Thank you for being Thank you again for that follow today. I feel bad waiting on Forza all these years. I was never a huge Xbox fan growing up, and I didn't have an Xbox my whole uh, gaming career. I actually didn't have one until a 360. And I uh, started playing some of the games and have a chance to like, play any of these, but now that you know I've got a decent piece to play it on, X-Bone and all that stuff. You know, uh, JT, how are you? Going a little bit hot in that slide, and yep, we're going, we're going off. No, we're not. Woo! Going off road. Enjoying this, so. All in. Thank you for that follow as well. Appreciate it. You guys are blowing up my uh, notifications tonight. Thank you all so much. We want uh, noobing my way around here, trying to learn the game. Graphics are amazing. I mean, I'm very impressed with them. Oh, wait, yep. I had a feeling that was coming. I definitely pushed my luck. And like I said, being a sim, we're not going to rewind. Nope, 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 nope. Let's go. Come on. Hopefully nobody's coming. Oh, yeah. Just, check, just looked over at my map, and <laughs> it's <laughs> it's pretty good lead, so we're pretty all right with that one. But I guess we're trying to push a little bit, but in the rain, you just got to keep it slow and steady. Hey, Jackson. Thank you for that follow, Will. Guys, you're all making me feel good tonight. Thank you all so much for the followers. Appreciate it. We're slowly grinding our way to 3,000. We've been streaming for over two years now. Get it? Final lap, yep. Oh, right. Ah, uh, that's actually the name of it. <laughs> uh, it's uh, it's literally just its name. I never changed its name. Um, yeah, it's. I have two bots. I use Nightbot and Doctor Angrybot. I'll take that win. First time in rain. That was fun. Yeah, I don't know what I'd name it. Maybe, maybe Motobot. I don't know. We'll see. Really enjoying this stuff. This is a lot of fun. I know it's early stuff in stock cars, but man, this is. Him having lots of fun. <laughs> Once again, thank you all for hanging out tonight. It really does mean a lot. Uh, had some slow streams lately. I, you guys you are just hit a milestone happy. from all of your driving. Now that you've hit a milestone, you get a choice of rewards. There'll be something great like cars, mods, or credits but they will be different with every milestone. See, I'm almost getting, like, here's the thing. 20,000 credits would be nice right now, but at the same time, a car worth 40,000 that I think you might be able to sell if you don't want it, but I could use it for a different class possibly than I want. I mean, that's a pretty cool skin, but I'm really thinking the car would be worth the 40K. What do you all think? I think that'd be the smart choice right now. If, I don't know, maybe I'm wrong, but I don't know, just feeling like a uh, 20,000 credits versus a 40,000 credit car for free. Of me, or because the card is free, it's it's a reward. Hello, I. I just go car, because like I said, I might be able to sell it. Now let's go car. Every add-on car you purchase is free to buy in game one time. Okay, buy right, this car and its upgrades. I see the car caught your eye. Well, this will increase your car collection score. And you just added another vehicle to your racing arsenal. As long as we keep doing well in races. What you're seeing oh. is your car collection. Every time you acquire a car, your car collection fills out and your collector score goes up. 
Raise your collector score to get your hands on higher tier cars and better rewards. That's cool. I mean, already some cars I really like in here. I mean, there's pretty much mine. I had a 69 all coming over. There's a 70. My dad had a 70, so that'd be kind of... 69 Nova. Actually, I had a 70 Nova. That's funny. What else we got in? A lot of stuff in here already, and this is just tier... Oh, we can drive a limo. <laughs> oh, it'd be great to race a limo. I think it'd be hilarious. Of course, I mean, the GSX can't go wrong. Is that a go-kart? I, I don't know. It almost looks like it. This is more of, I think it's like the spec, uh, spec V or whatever they are racing. And of course, you got the old Ford Falcons, like the Fox body style. That's a bug. This will be interesting to unlock more. We'll have to go through it a bit later. That's interesting. Loading, though. All Looks right. Like you got some credits to spend. Hey, why not invest in a prize crate? You might get mods, driver gear, or something else great. Yeah, I don't know if I want to buy a prize crate yet. Like, I don't have a ton of money. I mean, that's tempting just to get a basic or a premiere, maybe. What do you guys think? Should we keep uh, going and uh, save it up more money and then getting one late? Or should we just splurge on one and get one of the cheaper, like, $50,000 one? Maybe. 50000 credit, I should say. Why am I using dollars? Credits. <laughs> but at the same time, I feel like saving money for a car. I don't know. Kind of hard to decide. I just save. I'm going to save for now. We'll finish this uh, c uh, career, or not cr whole career, but this uh, circuit. If uh, we decide to get one, yeah. <laughs> My dang things later. I agree. I race. This will be fun. This is our first one at night. Oh yeah, yeah. Impulse buying is always tempting. I agree. No, it's it's hard not to splurge, that's for sure. I was on my brakes early and we slid there. Oh, it depends. I think there's a couple of tracks in here that are Oh no 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 god. I was on the brakes hard there and we slid like crazy. Okay with that. <laughs> Ways of learning. I even tried pumping and everything. I just I just got full lock on that. That was not a beginning. I'll break you up. straight away. I have a feeling we're going to be breaking hard here. But not as hard as I was expecting. Not good, at least. He's breaking harder than I am, though. Go outside. Round the outside. Round the outside. Round the outside. Excuse me. Pardon me. safe after that first lap of mayhem. That understeer. Ridiculous. At the same time, it's fairly realistic, so it's just, I can't get mad at it. 
Uh, subs. Like, if you want to sub to my channel, they're half off right now. So if you do, like, a sub, uh, $5 sub to my channel, it's only $2.50. If you do a $10 sub, it's only $5. And if you do a $25 sub, it's actually $12.50. Pretty cool. So they're doing a half off subs until, I think it's October 16th. So, and at the bottom, I have a, a sub goal of 25 subs, right? I think 16 right now. We're slowly building up our uh, subs, and that just helps me continue streaming daily. I sadly am unemployed, so every little bit helps, and uh, happy and thankful that they're doing this for us this month. I just uh, let everybody know that subs are half off if you wish to up to the channel. That was a great turn. Oh, and hey, don't even worry, JT. Hey, that's uh, that's what we're here for. There's no such thing as a dumb question. The only dumb question you'll ever have in your life is a question you never ask. Always remember that. As dumb as it is, that's a motto I've lived by. Sorry, I'll read that in two seconds. it was catch. Also, Jen's got questions or answers for you. There you go. Also, if you randomly have a uh, Twitch Prime, you can actually sub to somebody for free, and they get the five dollars sub, which is really cool. doing as well this race, but hey, at least we're keeping a lead. But the more we play, the better we'll get. Yeah, GT, if you link your uh, Twitch Prime or your Amazon Prime with your Twitch account, you can actually do a free sub. It's pretty cool to anybody you wish. The free $5 sub to any content creator you enjoy, you can toss them a free sub. We get to eat that $5 foot long. Yeah, Jen will tell you all about it. Thank you again, Jen. You're very helpful. I appreciate you hanging out with us. I was worried we're gonna understeer, so I kind of overbraked there. That's breaking. Oh yeah, sure. Give me one second. As soon as uh, actually, I don't think I have any mods in here, sadly. Yeah, let me give you a permit here. In a second. None of my mods show up anymore. <laughs> Gladly permit you one second. Or if you want, if it takes too long, you'd also whisper them to you. That's usually the fastest way to uh, toss somebody. I think if you're asking first, by the way, see, that's, that's when you know somebody knows Twitch. Oh, nope. No. Sorry. Oh, sorry. Got you. I don't think you should be timed out, but. No, it was only five seconds. You're fine. You're fine. Hey, I, I, I know you didn't mean to. You're fine. I think it's actually able to click your message, though, and still see the link as well. Let me know if you can't, JT, and I'll, uh, I'll post it again. <laughs> yeah, Nightbot is a little bit uh, savage. That's how you do it. Solid work out there. If you didn't get it for any reason, there is... This is also for anybody else, too. If you do have a uh, Twitch Prime and have not added your Twitch Prime or anything else, there you go. There you go. So hopefully that can help. Uh, yeah, if anybody has Twitch Prime and you haven't used it yet, you feel like, or uh, Amazon Prime, if you're like adding your Twitch to it, you can actually sub to anybody for free. Yeah, Joy's been playing on a capture card right now. I can actually switch between my two monitors a lot easier. <laughs> you like this design. We've noticed you've been racing with this car and this design. Sure. 
next race as this is loading up guys guys and gals i should say a little bit more drunk. i shall be right back in two seconds Trees call me Jackson Pilot because I splatter MC. I'm painting happy little trees call me Jackson Pilot because I splatter MC. Eddie Old Ghost, thank you so much for the follow. I saw that just in the last second. I hope you're doing well. Thank you so much for that. Appreciate it. You guys have been blown. Uh, yeah, here's that link one more time. Appreciate it. Thank you all. Uh, we've not had this many followers in a while in one night, so thank you all so much. It's been a good one so far. Also, Vikings, hello. What's up, bud? Just now saw that. Hope you're doing well. Oh, Epic Cart also followed. Thank you so much. We appreciate that. Thank you. All right. Slowly building as we go. It's the final race. Oh, epic party. Sorry. Yeah, I read that wrong. And the fury so far. Read that so I'm wrong. Hey, Toro uh, Sam, thank you also for the follow. God, you guys are blowing me up. Follow train. I don't know when the last time I had I one of those Vikings hosting as well. Thank you so much. That's nice of you. That's nice. The Watkins Glen. Wow, this is actually a track that I think I went to once when I was growing up in SoCal. And thank you, everybody. I do appreciate all the support tonight. It's been amazing. You all made my night so much better. What's my dream car? As odd as it is, a lot of people make fun of me for it, is I would kill for a uh, old-school ZL1 Camaro. A 1969 ZL1 Camaro. I don't know what it is. I just always wanted one. And as odd as it is for a daily driver, if I could have one, something a little bit different, I want a P100D from Tesla. On the outside, around the outside. Oh, of the grass. I'm so sideways. Worth. Totally worth. Uh, no, that's cool. I did not hear about that. I'm kind of intrigued about Star Wars Battlefront 2. Um, I played a lot of the first one. I enjoyed it. I got lucky to play the alpha with uh, one of my favorite streamers, actually, of all time, uh, Co Carnage. That was a lot of fun. Hopefully, we can maybe uh, meet back up and do it again this year. Oh, so worth the outside in the grass. 94 T-Top? Nice. Those are kind of like the IROC styles. Those are uh, pretty interesting. God, I mean, we definitely need to turn up their drive a a bit. I think this is getting a bit too easy now. Really enjoying the game. For my first ever Forza Motorsport, I'm really liking it. I mean, I've been part of racing games. You can tell by my name for years. And, uh, hey. Brad, thank you also for the follow. Appreciate that. I don't even know how many that is tonight. I've, I've not caught, kept count. Oh. Oh. Something rad. Thank you for the Twitch Prime uh, sub, the first sub of the night. Man, you just fed me a foot long $5. Thank you so much. Oh my God. Thank you so much for that. I do appreciate it. We're at, I don't know what it is, like a week straight of every day of stream. We got at least one sub. Thank you so much. So, so much. I appreciate that greatly. Man, also, and by the way, Something Rad makes amazing content on YouTube. Guys, check him out, please. Something Rad, same name on YouTube. Does anything from Dirt 3, uh, or Dirt 4, sorry, do just anything out there. Motocross games, all that kind of stuff. Check him out. Thank you so much. Get that. Thank you. That gift, though. Hey, if you guys know anything of uh, Odd Future and uh, Tyler the Creator, you might know where that's from. All right, let's see. This is going to be interesting. We're mid-turn. Here we go. Oh, yeah. That downshift back in. Ugh. Yeah, I tried to find the most ridiculous thing I could find for a sub emote, so. Oh, sorry, Jen. Hold on. Hold on. I'm 
Oh. oh, two in a row. Oh, JT also with the $5 foot long from Twitch Prime. Thank you so much. Back to back. We just had a follow train and then sub train. Thank you so much. Oh my god, you guys are making my night. There you go, Jen. You should no longer be banned. Go ahead and check really quick. Just be sure. JT, thank you again so much. And something rad, guys. Thank you both so much. It means a lot more than you guys get. Like I said, being unemployed. This is all the income I really get right now. So thank you both so much. Thank you again for all the follows tonight as well. You all make my night. Oh, uh, this is actually 2017. This is 2017. Uh, yeah, it says actually right there, I think. Uh, but yeah, it's a 2017. Hackback? Hack, 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 hackback! <laughs> I kind of like hackback better than hatchback. I don't know. I kind of like that. Oh, that was actually a beautiful turn. I will take that any day. Where's my bonus points for a good turn? <laughs> Again, thank you all so much for just hanging out tonight. The subs, the follows, everything. You guys have made my night. I did not expect any of that tonight. Oh, so much. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's the joy of Twitch Prime. You know what I mean? It's free to do and it helps people out. It's so cool. Well technically free with your Amazon Prime. But <laughs> yeah, I, I really do. I need to crank that AI. I, we're going we're gonna to we're gonna turn it up. I don't think we can do it mid-circuit, uh, but we'll do it on the next one. I can maybe try. I, I haven't tried yet, but I was worried it might screw with the uh, circuit we're in right now, but we'll turn it up for the next one. Next one's muscle cars, which will be really interesting. Oh, I thought we were going to the wall there. I just held it wide. Yeah, we really need to turn it off. It's on. It's either on hard or I think it's on advanced or whatever it is. But we need to definitely turn. It off. One thing I'm still loving about this game more than anything else is that, and I know it's been in other games on Xbox One, but I have yet to really play any that are like it, but the amount of traction slip you feel in the controller is amazing. I wish I had a wheel to play this, but it's really cool. Yeah, like with the throttle, like on, on your throttle side of your RT, you could feel the back end slip, which is pretty cool. Or it actually it's all wheel drive, so you can feel your tires slip a little bit. Then you're braking, uh, you're braking uh, rigor, you can feel it break as well. Oh, that's right, something right. You don't have a uh, Xbox One, do you? But for some reason, you did. Get your first paycheck on th Thursday. Congrats, dude. I'm so happy for you. Got that new apartment going. Got a new job. Everything is going so well for you. I'm so happy to hear all that. I have no idea. I, I'm, I'm always happy when my friends succeed at life. I'm a bit older than a lot of people, so I always have, like, dad things to say, I guess. But uh, you know what they always say? Time spent in wishing is time wasted, and you're definitely doing it, man. Got this going. Proud of you. On my lap, we got this. Yeah, the, the full game, I'm playing it actually on my Xbox One right now because the full game is having some issues on PC, but I'm, I'm having a feeling they'll patch it. And it's also a lot easier for me to play it off of my capture card, so... What I might actually do is run my uh, game, or my PC with the game, capture card it to my wife's PC and stream off that. I might try that next time. Loving the way the cars feel in this game. I did, like I said, it's it's I'm such a noob in Forza, but this one's great. 
Yeah, I, your 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 1070 is a big upgrade to Marcus's. I think I think he's got a 650, don't you? I think in your your uh, alpha or whatever it is. Again, let me know if my stream is uh, looking shady at all or not as good or anything at all. Just let me know. It's <laughs> Marcus Sheasley, Marcus Schmee's dog. Uh, what else is there? There's one that's like, like something like Toaster Pop Crop or something. <laughs> There's been a lot of great ones. The Schmee's dog. I think this is the final race of the circuits. Good here. Good to get my first one done. I will take that win. And that gap over a uh, second, <laughs> that was a bit rough. We definitely need to turn it up a bit. thousand overall we will take it be done not sure what it's going to look like when we uh, finish this out but you did it you finished your first series and you grabbed a spot on the podium fantastic work hell yeah you i did tackle the next hell yeah for the forza drivers cup you don't like that hound's tooth outfit i want that where do we get that gold and black hound's tooth I, that that's cool i want that Maybe I'd have to turn it white and black, you know, for a uh, Roll Tide Alabama color. <laughs> that was a good race. The fun first circuit. Yes, what do we get now? Ugh, do I really want that? Kind of like the rad, I don't know, I might, I might actually get the outfit. I don't know. I'll let you all choose. I've been a little bit more picky myself, so what do you guys think? Grab the 20000 and run, get the car that's worth 40000 or should we get the rad outfit? I think you all choose. And again, thank you for everybody hanging out today. <laughs> JT, no, I totally get it, man. I uh, we, we just rep Alabama being here close. Uh, my my wife's family's favorite team. I actually wasn't into college football until we got together. So. Can you sell cars? That is my question. I don't know if it's worth the 40K, though. You know what I mean? So if you could sell the car, then I don't know if it would be more value than the 20K. At the same time, that outfit's kind of cool looking. I'm liking mine, but I don't, I don't know. I'm right on the fence. I don't know. We already have quite a bit of money. Outfit, you can buy the car later. Yeah, that is true. That is true. Yeah, screw it. We're gonna get the outfit. Picking up more driver gear, I see. And you'll be able to wear it whenever you choose. Open now. Yeah. <laughs> there we go. That's actually kind of cool. Look like uh, Party City. 